of the Virgin. Your opposite sign is Pisces, with your equivalent Chinese sign being the Rooster. Dear Virgo, the first planet of importance I would like to chat about is Mercury, which is your ruling planet. Mercury is all about communication, writing, learning, teaching, travel and contracts. It retrogrades three times in 2015. And with any retrograde, it can bring back something of the past or just bring forth issues that need your attention. As your ruling planet, there's a greater sensitivity to the retrograde cycle. The first of these is on the 22nd of January through to the 11th of February falling into the areas of your health, daily duties and daily work routines. So, there may be a need to revisit issues within one of these areas. The second is on the 19th of May to the 12th of June. And this is where you may, without realising it, have blinkers on or become tunnel visioned with tasks, people and situations around you. As a result, obvious and appropriate solutions or choices may be overlooked. So this is a time to check and recheck the whole situation, as well as look carefully at any travel plans. Be careful before you say, do or act upon anything. The third Mercury retrograde is on the 18th of September to the 10th of October, where your ruler could be manifesting some deeper, darker secrets, passions or desires within you and be shedding light on what may have been previously hidden. Here, Mercury can also bring a magical manifestational energy which is specific to you and you alone, if you're one of the lucky Virgos. And the real good news is, lucky Jupiter, the planet of success, money and wealth, enters your sign in August 2015 for a year-long stint. This move has the ability to bring positive opportunities, new experiences and the power to manifest personal ambitions and desires for you. Now Lilith, an asteroid, is also there. And Lilith has an energy that can be fierce, powerful, even sexual. But with the lucky god of gods Jupiter in your sign simultaneously, this is good because the duo could be a dynamo of transformation and change if you get behind your desires, wishes and ambitions. Pluto adds to the deep, dark, passionate or the hidden within you as he stays in your relationship sector. Ooh la la! With Uranus, the unusual, staying in your intimacy sector, put the two together and you may change your current relationship to have a bit more fire and passion in it. The singletons around could attract a more physical and passionate relationship along with the desire to experiment within it. Ooh la la, Virgo, enjoy. Finally, Venus, the planet of love and beauty and magnetic attraction is in your sign on the 25th of July to the 5th of September. And again, this could possibly bring back past loves or love issues or emotions of the past may return. But it's nothing you can't handle, Virgo. Lots more happening, but that's it for now. Do join me on Facebook and Twitter, and do join me live on screen every week. Dates are on my blog with the monthly horoscopes. Dear Virgo, have a great 2015.